right now whilst I've last seen this game. <laughs> I still remember what I had to do to make it, um... The shy bandit didn't show up. I was expecting him. Because of what happened last time. The stupid memory game thing, I have to beat all the questions in order to get an I and a thing I'm supposed to get, I think that was... Like, a thing of a lens, like a camera or something, I don't really know. I didn't go any further in this part, I just left immediately. Okay, I just wanted to save it, so... I guess the sniff isn't doing anything. I need the cards again. <laughs> Wait. 500. Wasn't it more expensive than this? Like a thousand or something? Is this different? Uh. Great. Of course, I have too many. Yes. I return to the game only to find out I have too many in there. And I'm going to sell some so I get some money out of it. I'm not going to get rid of them right here. Good, Shy Band, it's not bothering me. This map is so big now that if I go off the edge, he just cheats, and there's no way to catch him. So I don't know if it's going to be different because it's a requirement now, but first I'm going to try doing it. Oh, I think this is still about the train, yeah. But okay, so first I'm going to try, because I'm not that tired anymore. In the past episodes, I was a little bit tired. I'm not that tired anymore. I'm more ready to do stuff in this game. And I'm going to check his toad again. He's going to tell me. Yes. It's not fabulous. As you can see, I don't have it, obviously. So first, I'm going to try doing all the questions. Because that's what I need to do. It's a requirement. I have to get all the questions right first. I'm going to try that. With just my memory, see how well I do, because when I'm under pressure, <laughs> I have a hard time <laughs> remembering things right away if I'm under pressure, like little things like that. So I had some trouble last time. If it doesn't work and... I don't get the thing. I'm just going to take a picture of whatever part gets to me. If I have another tablet, I can do that. That's the plan, because I, just, I want to move on. I don't want to get stuck at that part. Well, I'll be back when I'm done with this. Okay, I think I have enough space now. Just gonna get this part of Camp Lee I never noticed before. How long has that how long has that been there? I never noticed this part didn't have color before. It's crazy it took me so long to notice that. I've been safe for the shy band that came, but still risky. <sighs> I don't want. I really don't want to test my memory on this still. If they just kept the cards up, I wouldn't have an issue. They take away the cards, and then I nearly forget. So I'm going to have to be quiet and repeat it to myself. Yeah, I think this is different. 
Wasn't he a thousand? Wasn't he a thousand coins before? Why is it only five hundred now? It's still thirty cards, which I think was the same. Are you kidding me right now? Oh my goodness. For real? Is this for real? This makes me really want to just take pictures and get it over with. Because if I get one wrong, I'm done. What do I do? I guess what I can do... Okay, I last saved at the prism port place, so if I just... And it doesn't save... It doesn't all save here. So that means if I have to... If I fail and just go do this and leave, it won't all save. I would assume, which means I would not have the cards that I just got. So I would be able to get the cards for the for whatever answer it's randomized to now. So maybe it's not that bad as long as I don't like save right now or anything. Okay, I'll try them. I'll try my memory. not that confident about it. What does he say? So if I just like fail and leave? I'll be able to get the new cards with all of my coins back because it shouldn't all save. I guess it's gonna be different because the answers change. It changed so much, the cards are gonna be useless. If I leave. I'm just going to be quiet. Because I have to get every single one right. This one car I had a real problem with when they painted it halfway. I hated it so much because it was just so precise for me to remember, and of course I messed up. Now, but I was tired that other time. I'm not that tired anymore. I got enough rest, so I think I'll be able to handle it this time. It's just you have to be perfect, else it's wrong. The other stuff I think I'm going to be fine with as long as I. Don't get distracted. I just hate that's not as fun as Sticker Stars version. This is way worse. Oh.
Oh no. I forgot if it's a big flower or if it's a small flower. I'm already messing up. Was it? I, I, I don't remember if it's a big one or a small one. I wasn't paying attention to the size of the car, of the, of the, of on the card. I think it was normal size. <laughs> I think now I would notice if it was a different size. Oh, I forgot to I for I didn't notice. Whatever. I didn't notice I was running low on the red paint. Who came up with the stupid idea for the painting precisely one anyway? That was the one that actually did mess me up. I was paying attention the other time, I still. Just one more? Oh, it has to be this one. I'm super tempted to take a picture of it. I don't want, you know what, well, you know. I think I'm going to take a picture of this. Sorry, I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk forgetting exactly where it is, so I'm just going to get my other tablet and take a picture of it when it shows up. I lied. I'm not interested in seeing my memories good enough for this. I just want to get the game over with. Well, I couldn't find my other tablet, but my 3DS works too. I just need a little picture of it to make sure I don't mess up. By the way, this was like a really stupid idea, whoever came up with this part. Just so you know. And this one's actually easier to recognize than what I got because it, I think the one I got before was a hammer. I forgot the position of where it was on the on it. But this one's actually a lot easier to memorize. I, well, for me it is. I like how they chose blue paint. So it blended with the background more. My DS still got it. I knew I was gonna try to take a picture of it.
Well, for a moment I thought I didn't have the fan. Then I really didn't. I didn't sort the cards. For a moment I was like, how do I not have the fan? Okay, from what I saw and what I got, it really looks like it. Were they expecting you to get so exactly perfect? And yeah, it's right above like the first page. Much better. Okay, so I do still have to answer the other ones, but I did manage to handle the one that was the hardest for me so far. So now I know if I have to redo everything, I'm just going to take a picture of my DS because it worked. Well, I have to. I have no choice. I don't think I've seen what the other ones are like yet. Well, I'm really testing my memory. Oh great, was that a big boot or a small boot? I messed up again. I forgot to remember if it was a small one or a big one. I think it was a small one. It has to be a small one, right? Because I think you want to give me unpainted cards and kind of the unpainted card is... Oh, great, there's also a big one. It was a small one, right? Also, what order am I supposed to put the cards in? Because there's no way it tell. Was it this? Oh! I don't need to put it in any order. It works either way. And yes, it was a small boot. Cause I was like, uh, what order am I supposed to put that in? <laughs> I, I, okay. I'm so scared to mess up. I hate this so much. Triple Warren double. Spring triple Warren double. Spring triple Warren double. Spring triple Warren double. Spring triple Warren double. And that is how I remember. <laughs> I repeat these little phrases that I associate the cards with in my head. I know it's called a hot slipper, but I like calling it a spring. And that is easier for me. Triple war and then the double fire. 
That was kind of hard to see, by the way. I don't like that. the last one. Really? There's two of them? There's two left. Four? I'm already having trouble remembering just three. I have another idea. So I could just put videos together. I could just like stop recording, see the footage, if I forget, and then, like, start recording again, when I figured it out. That's another thing I have in mind to do. I might just do it if I absolutely just can't remember one of these. Metal big line eek. Metal. The metal boot. Oh, this is different. The metal boot. I mean, sorry, the iron jump. <laughs> I also call those differently. No. <laughs> it was the iron jump, right? Okay, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. It's good. Except in the treasure chest where you stole it from? If you don't know what I'm talking about, watch the last episode. I found the treasure chest in, like, for in Fortune Island, and there was a note left behind that it was taken by the, sniff it, by the sniffer with it. So, and I'm like, oh, you've got to be kidding me. So the worst one so far was the painted card one. To be honest. So I'm glad I won't end up perfectly fine this time. And by the way, if you get, if you start getting them wrong, an urchin will come closer to the bubble. And I think it's a game over we lose, but you know, I haven't exactly been like, oh yeah, I'm going to try it right now. More interested in finishing the game first. sniff it but yeah imagine imagine like sticker star didn't do this with this show I mean at least at least I didn't see him say that in sticker star yeah imagine this for real like oh yeah you get it wrong and your save file is gone imagine if this is a threat that is for real I am going to freak out. This is like a real. If this is a real threat, by the way. If you know if this is a real threat, tell me in the comments. I'm really curious. Cause wow, I mean, at first I'm like, it's instant game over. Oh yeah, I know about that. But then he adds, "Your save file will be erased forever." That is so stressful. I might just stop recording and look at the video just to be sure. Because <laughs> I don't want to have to do the entire game all over again from the start. <sighs> okay. Oh, look! <laughs> just kidding! <laughs> 
<laughs> By the way, awesome fourth wall break. That actually had me going there for a moment. I can't believe the game more part, but oh yeah, I'm going to erase your save file forever. I won't get credit for cleaning the art. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. Wait, there's parts. This is like this is the worst version of Sniffer with it. I know this is the only second version, but me. The worst. Um, unless Origami King has a third version of this game, I haven't actually played a game all the way because it got kind of boring. Eh. Drill, drill Star and. and eat. That was horrible. I, I don't trust myself with this one. I didn't get a good look at them because of all the stupid stuff covering them. So I'm just going to do exactly what I told you I will. I'm going to stop recording I'm going to look at the footage. So ha! Huh? I don't, I, don't really, I really don't care that I'm cheating. By the way, it's not like he's. It's not like he has any clue that I'm actually cheating here. It's not like he's like, oh yeah, I'm recording. I can totally cheat if I want to. So I'm going to be back after I double check what I just saw. I actually didn't guess what the third car was, right? So and I saw that when I looked at the video. This would basically be my worst nightmare right now if I wasn't recording this. It was a hurl hammer, but I thought it was eek for some reason. This should be right. This really should be right. This is what I saw. I double checked like three times. Yeah, imagine if at the final part, he actually does what the toad did at the beach. Where, where you got, you guessed the right toad, but they switched up the answer. What if I'm actually right, and I have the footage to prove it, but then they switched the answer at the last moment. <laughs> and it's like, what? And it's like, what? That's not fair. I'm going I'm going to kind of freak out with that. <laughs> and I'm going I'm going to be like, "Uh, oh, excuse me. I have the video here to prove that you are cheating." To prove that totes are cheating, we put paint on the one that had whatever that thing was. Top pow and double boots. I'm a lot more confident with this one. The problem is that I don't want to risk it, so I'm just going to check again really fast. Yeah, I think it's I call I call it a top. It's a spike helmet. I call it a top because it reminds me of spike top enemies. It's easier to remember. So I'm go I think it was the spike helmet, the pow block, and the double jump, which I called double boots a lot of the time. Okay, it, it does seem alright. Yeah, I was a lot more confident this one. If I was a little kid playing this game, it would definitely be not very fun. I would assume that if I was having a hard time kept on filling, they would make this easier version of Sniffer with it. Because on some other parts where I kept on filling, like when we were on the ship, they made this easier version or 
for you to actually be able to move on instead of having to do it over and over again. So I'm going to think that there's some kind of easier version of Sniffer with it if the game knows to keep on failing, which I would have done if I was little, probably. Because I'm not used to memory games besides in Mario Party. I guess one day I'll come back here and check things out. What happens if you get the instant game over? What happens if the urchin pops a bubble? Stuff like that. What he has to say about it. This one was the easiest one for me, by the way. The re recall thing. So I might not even... Well, let's just see what they do this time. It, it could be harder. I'm still going to check, because this is the last round, and if I get it wrong, you know, it's going to be really terrible, so I'm not even going to risk it, I'm just going to check it again. Even if I'm super confident, I'm still going to check again. They're all giant. The spring, the mushroom, and the hammer. The spring, the mushroom, and the hammer, all big. Check the footage. What if this is like the, seriously, seriously? What if this is like the toads where they swap the cards from what you actually saw? What well, if this is like the toads? What if the final round is like the toads? I, I am going to yell at him if they dare pull that off on me. See, look, I'm going, I'm going to check, so I'm going to know exactly for sure what the blooper was holding. It was the blooper, right? Yes, it was the blooper. The blooper was holding the, the giant hammer. The big hammer, yes. If they switch the cards... Okay, <laughs> they didn't switch the cards. <laughs> You know what? I was totally expecting them to switch the card to what the Toads did. I was 100%, okay, 99%, but still, I really was expecting them to switch the cards. Surprised they didn't switch the cards. I know the paint bucket would have had a thing to say about it if they had. So, I'm going to guess the Toad and Trash Can said it has a lens. Here's my guess. Camera? I can't believe how many times I would have lost if I wasn't recording. I wasn't really paying attention, by the way. I just wasn't paying attention to the right stuff sometimes. I'm right, it is a camera. Oh, and there's these pink sniffets. I don't think we've seen pink sniffets yet. I wonder if they're gonna do anything. Yeah, I'm correct to camera. What else has a lens, to be honest? And when was Selfie a word in a Mario game? Hmm. Use it wisely. Wait, what? Does this one say? Okay, that's weird. I'm, go I'm going to leave now. Goodbye. I'm afraid to go back because I'm afraid the trap door is going to open again. <laughs> so I'm just going to get the story. <laughs> Would it have actually been instant game over and you have to redo everything? Would they have an easier version? That's the only question I really have about this. Yes, please save. The Shy Guy Bandit's being really good right now. 
He hasn't been bothering me. Where do I need to go now? It was... So, but I don't, I don't actually like Fortune Island very much. I just don't like that place very much. It hasn't been very fun. And there's some puzzle that I'm currently stuck on. I'm going to try to figure it out today. Oh, I left my three here. So, it's the game over. I suppose the urchin just drops on top of you if you get one wrong. And pops a bubble at the end, which is kind of funny because Paper Mario, Mario here doesn't seem to be affected by water. But I guess he wouldn't be able to breathe through. Wait, what do I need to buy? Lots of springs, right? There was lots of springs. Of course, if I don't use the camera the correct way, I'm just going to reset the entire game. I've reset this game multiple times in past episodes because I do something at the wrong time. And then I know when I'm supposed to do it. It's a very good strategist. Oh no, I used this wrong. Just to reset. What was I need? I think it was the... Sorry, I keep on calling them springs. See, the, the hop slippers. I like to call these things springs. I actually might want this. And I only have four mushrooms. Oh, the big one's expensive, isn't it? I don't know if I'm gonna ever need to tell again. Okay, so I know the fire flowers don't work on the dry bones, but I don't think I have I have tried ice flowers on them yet. And the thing with ice flowers that the ice flowers do work on dry bones in other games, so I would assume they'd be different. So now I'm kind of wanting more ice flowers and fire flowers at the moment. In case I might get a few of these. No, it's the huge discount we get a black and white version instead of the colored one. Hope I made the right decisions there. I forgot I could do that. Nice. Yes, the Shy Bandit is very absent. That is exactly what we need. So that's good. Maybe he's satisfied now that he stole colors from me. I mean, paint from somewhere twice. I guess the camera is going to be for the boss fight, I would assume. Oh, I just don't know who I'm fighting. Yeah, uh, it's giving me a hop slipper, so I think that's where- Oh, I forgot not to jump! <sighs> yeah, it was the hop slipper I needed. I should have gotten a few more hop slippers. I'm kind of worried that I don't have enough now. I'm going to see if two of these are good enough. I 
And this might be a longer episode than one hour, because I haven't been playing this game in a long time. So I kind of want to get back to things. Okay, it was something to do with the candles. So I have to look at how they're lined up in the normal world and connect that with the parallel world. And by the way, the parallel world has spike traps, so I have to remember where they're where they're at in the normal world. Oh, it's back! The fire bro's back. Ugh, oh, it's so annoying. So we're going to notice these spike traps, yeah, and you can see them perfectly fine. But in the parallel world cap, so left, left, right, and middle. And the parallel world does give you a little hint, like you see, just see barely the little lines on the ground that means there's a door that's going to open up. So since I have, might have to remember these, um, how these are lined up, I'm going to watch for the lines in the ground. These torch lines, I assume. Oh, I mean. What, am I supposed to pay attention to the ones that aren't lit? Because I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. So if I'm supposed to be paying attention to the ones that aren't lit, I would say one, three, and four. And what was here? Oh yeah, that room is all covered in smoke, I think. And this is the chest where I found the note. I think. Yeah. And this goes somewhere else. Yes. That's why I went that way to shortcut out. I only like the parallel world in the. Oh, I already forgot what it was called. Vortex, Vortex Island, right? Yes. That's the only moment. That's the only place I like the parallel world at because of the nice shy guys. These could be less annoying in Koopa Troopers because it's like one hit. Like, all I have to do is jump on them. Or them. Oh, I forgot. Oh, yeah, that was one of the platforms. I got distracted by the dry bones. And this should be in the middle. So, okay, maybe? Yes! Yes, I finally gained it! Okay, it was one, three, and four. And now I go back. Or I go that way, okay. The dry bone flare distracted me. I forgot I was on the platform. I started the spike traps. See, my memory can be so much better if I'm not under a lot of pressure. For real. What does he have to say now? Let's go see what's happening with the volcano and the parallel world. Hey, right, good, that shows up. Alrighty, we are making progress. That's a good start. Something delicious. Wonder if we're going to see some shy guy. Yeah. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
Is it what is going on? Oh yes. Not good. Just like in the normal world. Yep. But what do we do about the smoke? That's what I don't know. I don't know what to do about the smoke. That's the problem. Oh, no chest this time, just a hole. I'm just, I'm really curious still what a camera could possibly be used for. Like, if it's for fighting a boss, why would you need the camera? Oh, look! It was a toad cooking something the entire time? Are you for real? I did not see that coming. Alright, fine, maybe someone's cooking something. I would expect, I don't know, maybe a shy guy again? Vortex, I, it was a shy guy's fault running a washing machine that created the whirlpool, but we have a toad that's at fault now. And I was really not expecting that. I did not see that coming. Who is the toad anyway? Some pirate. Wait, 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 wait. Is this the legendary pirate that the ship... Sorry, I'm, tr I'm trying to find it. Wait. Okay, so that the 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 captain toad on the ship was like, oh, we got the ship from the pirate captain that went missing. If I remember correctly, this could be him right here. This could be that missing pirate captain. Oh, great. Well, it's too bad they're booze. I was hoping they were more dry bones or easier to deal with. Cause what the oh. Definitely a pirate captain. In a minute. You've probably been there for days. Yeah, so they cover their eyes for- Okay, okay, I can actually hammer them. That's good, but they're- But if you don't manage to hammer them in time, they cover your eyes for too long. They'll appear behind you, and then they'll attack. That was better than I was expecting. Okay, how, what's he, how is he going to react to me just taking this? <laughs> That'd be funny if he attacked him like the shy guy did when I took away his laundry machine. I, I felt bad for that shy guy, so I didn't, I didn't fight him. But unfortunately, there's nothing else to see if we don't fight him. Oh, really? I have to make cards again, of course. <laughs> I should have left like one or two space, one or two open in case this happened. Is he mad? Yes! Wait! The shy guy was like, how dare you rain that out when I took away the laundry machine? And this toad's like, how dare you rain on my grill? And the, and the, and the, and the shy guy, the laundry guy was like, it was on the spin cycle, right? So this is in a very similar format to what the laundry guy has to say. That's very interesting. Don't tell me tell is that tell the pirate captain's actually going to attack me. Is he the counterpart of wait, is he the counterpart of the laundry guy? Because he sounds really similar. Oh. <laughs> Aggressively until you're mildly annoyed. That's so threatening. <laughs> See, the toads can't even make a proper threat. <laughs> That's so cute. Yes, remember the laundry guy? Actually, more like days, but we're not going to talk about it. Okay, uh, do I make it up to you by leading you back, leading you to the ship? I think that's his ship. I really thought the toad was going to attack me. He sounded similar to the laundry guy that did attack me when I... Actually, I don't think there's any else to see here. Yeah, nothing else. Gonna look behind. There really is nothing else to see here. Oh, 
I do a lot better making progress when I'm not tired. Oh, I missed. Whoa, what happened? What's the problem? He's just a pirate toe. I like him, to be honest. What's your problem, Hu Hu Huey? Why do I have trouble pronouncing his name? Yeah, like, what's, what's his problem? I like this pirate toe. He's perfectly fine. I don't mind him tagging along. He's... He's more polite than the laundry guy was, who just straight up attacked us. But I didn't blame him, because it was my fault, really. Because now the laundry guy is not going to have anything to wear. The laundry guy was in Vortex Island, by the way. I think I forgot to mention that. No? Anything else to say? <coughs> I had to cough. <coughs> Oh, oh, I'm, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to get you. It was a stupid boo. I hate the boos in this game. It's so annoying. <clears throat> it would be, but yeah, it would be a lot worse if you can't defeat them right away. Okay, I really want to see what's over here. Oh, you know what? Never mind. I think those are ice flowers. I would assume they're ice flowers because ice is. Because there was an ice bro here, ice seems to be the thing in the parallel world. <laughs> he almost forgot what they look like! Yeah! Is this captain going to recognize this toad? was stuck there. I mean, he's kind of a captain too. Oh right! I was so I was so caught in the excitement of finding the cap, the legendary captain, that I completely forgot why we were there in the first place. It was to clear the smoke in the room. Yeah, see, this one's fire, bro, and the other one's ice, bro. So it's like fire flowers, in the normal world, and ice in the parallel world. I know it's your save block here, this is right before a boss fight, I assume. And according to Drag, I totally need a camera for this boss fight, I just don't know when to use it. It could be like the other one where I was confused at first, I was like, wait, am I supposed to use it right now? Because I couldn't tell how to attack the ship. And then it's like, oh, I have to use tail. So it's very new. Yep, here comes the boss fight. I didn't realize Star was that close, by the way. So who's it gonna be? Is it gonna be the ugly one I don't like, Wendy? Because, um, uh, that one's associated with the beach in New Super Mario Bros. Wii, so it might be the ugly one. <laughs> and, and, and that one just, like, pops up, like, pops in, like, right out ceiling on top of us. And it's like, nope. Oh, or maybe the clam. Okay. It's a Koopaline. I knew it! It had to be that one. 
That's my least favorite of them all, by the way. I was kind of hoping this one wouldn't be in the game, well, whatever. So, what's it gonna be? Is the camera going to distract her? Because this one's so stupid? Is that what the camera's gonna be for? I thought, I thought she was going to fall from the ceiling. Wow. I, I really thought she was going to fall from the ceiling. Gonna throw rings at us, probably. But that was a correct guess, because I'm new to Super Mario Bros. Wii. This one might be like Morton. I just try normal attacks first. Because I tried to get an idea of things. Like what I might need or whatever. But it could be they restored her health and then... I wasted cards. Oh yeah, I also have the ice flower chart. for the save blocks right before the boss fights in case I need to reset. Okay, I think she's being affected. Yeah. Yeah, she is. So far. Ooh, my first excellent in a long time for the hammer. Just has seems to have more health than the other ones. What's going on here? Oh, the coins hurt me too. That's a lot to take in. Were those coins or were those the yellow rocks? <laughs> yeah, I ice fire on a fire bro. <laughs> That's funny. I'm using an ice flower on fire, bro. Oh, I just realized it took a lot of health. Everything appears to be working so far. I don't know what the thing's going to be. I mean, what the twist is going to be here. I guess it has to do with the camera. Those are coins! No, dude, coins hurt me. Oh, I thought for sure I didn't time that block correctly there. <laughs> Same thing as before? Okay. If you insist. I also have big fire flowers that I'm not going to use the moment in case she restores her health. Oh, I ran out of the paint for the blue. Guess I'll use the normal size fire flowers now. So usually after you attack them with the thing that you need, they're super weak and are defeat almost immediately, so I don't think I have to really worry if I run out of paint for painting the cards. Oh, it's a gold shy guy. Those can only be defeated with metal.
I forgot about those metal ones. I do have an iron jump, but I might not be able to paint it because I'm out of the paint. What I want to happen is for the first iron blue to take out the fire and then I take out the gold shy guys layer. That's what I hope it's gonna happen. If it doesn't happen, it's fine. I have plenty of mushrooms. So I can restore as much health as I want to. And they're all painted too. Okay, so the first one takes that one out. And then this one will remove the gold layer. That was the plan. That was just in case. Now I'm going to try just using these on her. Seems to be working. So when do I need a thing, game? Well, I'm gonna use a big mushroom for this one. Whoa, it's based on the- it's in time with the music! I didn't notice that before. It's in time with the music. Okay, time for the camera. Whoa, what was she- what is she gonna do if I don't use the camera? That's kinda creepy. Oh, don't one up mushrooms restore paint? Well, I don't have any of those anymore. I'll have to consider getting the one up mushrooms. For next time. How much is this restore? Oh yeah, of course it doesn't tell you how much the mushrooms restore, it's so helpful. I didn't add that in the description. So I don't know if I should just use one or two. I'm gonna go with one. I think you made it clear that I need the camera. Luckily it allows me to paint it even though I'm out of both red and blue paint. It still allows me to paint it. So I think we're good. So what's the camera going to do anyway? It's a shield? Okay, I wasn't I wasn't thinking of a shield. I was thinking of it's going to attack her. I didn't think it would be a shield. And yeah, she is using a ring. Oh. <laughs> Wait, she can't tell that isn't us? <laughs> what a stupid idiot. Idiot. She can't tell that's not us. This is great. <laughs> this is just great. I only have yellow paint left. So I was thinking, is she going to use her reins because she has the reins thing? So she did use that one. I wonder if that would have been instant game over if I hadn't done the camera. And that's why they emphasize the camera so much. Because she referenced it multiple times, like, take a picture, say cheese and stuff. So maybe it would have been an instant game over. Oh, she's almost down. 
I can't believe I was worried about this boss fight. This boss fight is very good. Very good boss fight. Wasn't that bad at all. Like the other ones, once you get familiar with how they, with what it wants you to do, how you're supposed to fight back, it's not actually that bad. Tired of looking at this. How about break it? Oh yeah, great threat, I guess. Wow, that would have been instant game over. That would have been instant game over. <laughs> wow, instant game over. Like, bam. Oh yeah, time to use my big. Fireflies, even though I don't have the paint left, I think they'll still work. There's no way to paint these, but they still work if they're unpainted. I'm going to only use one case, and next time I'll get the one-up mushrooms. Because I remember what they're supposed to be used for now. Yeah, it doesn't let me paint them at all. Not even the slightest. Neither the fire or the ice. But I think it'll still hurt her. Oh yeah! I didn't even need the pop slippers. <laughs> that was that was pretty nice. <laughs> that was so funny seeing her fall for the photograph. I was not expecting that. That would have definitely been instant game over. <laughs> Yeah, it actually was Days Land. How long has it been since I started this game? It's already been like a month, I think. Has it been that long? You are disgusting. Go away, please. I don't like you. That's one of my least favorite characters in the game, by the way. So I'm glad the fight was quick and pretty easy, and it actually was kind of amusing with the photograph thing. I like that. Huh. Poor Captain. Wait, who's here? Has already been claimed. Hey, it's the legendary Captain! Um, other Captain. <laughs> Yes. Yes. Most of them were empty. There was treasure. But we were too late. Oh no. The lovely grill. Oh, that's scary. Why is he sad? Ah, oh, yes. The treasure. We were too late. Oh, it's okay. Hey, hey, we got the paint star back. Oh, don't be sad. I don't like seeing him sad. Yes! True words. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> yes! That's perfect. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, <laughs> what? That's exactly what I was gonna say. <laughs> yes, that's our treasure. Don't have to pay for that. One coin. I wonder if I can find the paint to get this. Doesn't look like it. So we're going to see what memory this star has in store, and then I'm going to end this episode. Here's our beautiful, grand paint star. I can't help but call them grand paint stars because of Super Mario Galaxy. They look like the Grand Stars of Super Mario Galaxy, and yeah, I like that name better. 
So it might be that yellow mustard cafe place that's where we're gonna be going to next because it has this big purple spot that the Toad's on vacation is at. Let's. Yep, I was right. I didn't want to see this for quite a long while now, so I'm glad I'm finally going to see what's up with this little area. Oh, it's it's a pit! It was a pit the entire time. That was the last thing I was expecting. It was a pit. I painted as much of it as possible to see if there was any clues to what it could be, and I had I still had no idea it was a pit. It was just like something yellowish, purplish. It's gonna be a horror movie again. <laughs> the second one, I think it was the second one, showed something like a horror movie. <laughs> oh, that's so many shy guys. No, it's gonna be a horror movie again! Oh, there's Bowser! He's in the fountain! The poor toad right there! That's it. Slurp guys. The shy guys with straws. But why are they so pink right? That is a good question. They slurp toads too. Yeah, what's going on with Bowser here? It's gonna be the fourth one. Oh I only I only have two of them left. This is quite a long, really good game by the way. Really impressed by it. I only have two left, so I might just beat this game before summer ends, and that was the goal I have here. So I'm really excited about that. Oh, yes, it's the heart! I'm going to get a... a max HP up. Something I really love about the game is that the major boss fights aren't that big of an issue. Instead of it just being a painful struggle, it actually goes by pretty smoothly, and it's not like it just keeps you there for like forever, just trying to figure it out. Like once you have the thing you know about, just like take them down pretty simply. It's pretty simple to do that, and that's something I really am enjoying about this game. Because it means it doesn't get boring as easily. I <laughs> like all the confetti. Ooh. So what did he say? Yeah, why were the shy guys sucking up the toads? Good question. All oh, right, there was some kind of card museum that I'm going to ignore the existence of for now because I just want to play the game. That's it for this episode. I'm going to stop recording here and I'm going to go to Mustard Cafe and I'm going to see what's up because I'm pretty excited to finally see what's going on the Mustard Cafe. I've been really curious about it. Okay, before I go, I'm going to see if the Shy Bandit makes some appearance. Won't be good if it does though, please don't. Oh, it changed! The music changed! And it's just a peach thing. It's alright. I love how the music gets better and better as you progress in this game. Alright, bye for now. I'll see you in the next episode. So we'll be going to Mustard Cafe.